Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Today I am super uber duper excited. And if you're thinking what the hell have I just clicked on and you're new here, hello, welcome, my name is Meg. And I like to talk about all the superficial things around here, the things that don't really matter, but they bring us a little bit of joy in the everyday craziness that is life. All things that are makeup, skincare, hair care, homeware, fashion. We're not great at all of them, but I have a passion for them and I love them and it brings me joy. So if those things bring you joy too, hit subscribe down below. Join my little family, join my warm hug. Um, join the inner circle of trust and let's just get into this you guys you guys I got gifted a boatload of makeup from QVC QVC you heard it right I had a little bit of a like a wet my pants moment like a little bit of a oh, run to the toilet I'm gonna scream um, when I saw an email from them uh, from their team to say can we send you some stuff and you just kind of like put it in a video and I was like hell yes so today is uh, it's not like I suppose, is it an ad? I don't really know the laws on these things. I should probably look these things up. But it's like hashtag gifted, you know? They haven't paid me to say anything. They haven't like sponsored the video or anything. They just gifted me a boatload of stuff to talk about with you and share with you guys. And that is exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm very, very excited. It's QVC. QVC. I've been shopping on QVC since I was about 14. It's QVC. See, I'm so excited. You know, like round here, you know, like we're a little small family, we're a little small inner circle around here. So when QVC comes knocking, <laughs> honey, I'm opening up the door. <laughs> so, okay, hang on. Am I gonna tip this all out? Oh, okay. What I love QVC for, what I love QVC for is American brands and bundles. They're bundles give me life. A perfect example of the bundles is their benefit range. Now they have makeup just as individuals, uh, like core products like Hoola, their real mascara, all those things that we know and love. And they also have quite a few of their newer items as well, which I will get into. But a perfect example of the bundles is one of their mascara bundles that I saw, which was three mascaras, basically the price of two. If you shop Benefit Mascaras, then you'll know they're roughly about 22, 20, like between 20 and 25 pounds. They're roughly like 22, 23 pounds. For this bundle, you pay just under 40, and that is including postage and packaging, for three mascaras. Now, this is a bundle price. Like I said, there's loads of different bundles. I got the Bad Gal Bang, which is actually one of my favourite, favourite mascaras. The Roller Lash Mascara, which again is a bloody brilliant mascara. And their new Their Real Magnetic mascara so if you wanted like this is why i love qvc to be honest and this is like they haven't paid me to say it this is genuinely why i decided to say yes to this collaboration is because i'm like hello bundles yes please you get these two brilliant mascaras which we all know and love and then you can try something new from benefits line and i really wanted to try this mascara this is like quite an expensive mascara you know i'm looking on boots website now and this is 24 pounds 50 by itself now i wouldn't necessarily pay 24 pounds 50 for mascara maybe wait for 10 percent off but for this bundle you get three mascaras for less than 40 pounds including postage and packaging I, I think that's i think that's pretty good I think that's pretty good. So I'm really, really impressed. Another thing that I love about QVC is all of the videos and demonstrations of their products, which I really love. We all know when it comes to swatching things that sometimes internet swatches aren't necessarily true to colour or you can't see the payoff or you can't see how it's been used or applied. So I like to be able to see with some products, especially investment pieces, you know, things that aren't just 10 quid, things that cost 20, 30, 40, 50 pounds that you can see how they work. And I really, really like that about them. So yeah, there's a really cool bundle mascara. You could also buy a couple of bundles and distribute them between friends for like birthdays or Christmas. Like these are full size mascaras and they're worth like 20 to 25 pounds each. It's a pretty good deal. The next thing that I've got in here is this. Now, interesting fact, the first QVC haul I did was one of these Tarte, Tarte, or Tarte, Toasted Tarte something palette. What's it called? Ugh. Oh, it's just the Tartlet palette. So both of these are from QVC and I got brushes with both of these. Do I have a brush on hand? I don't know if I can bother to find it. But I got a brush that came with a Tartlet Toasted palette and this is a really, really nice palette. It smells of like cocoa. It's not new by any means, but they're just really, really good palettes. And I got the Tartlet palette, which is that cool toned one. This is my very first purchase from QVC. Um, so like, <laughs> kind of coming full circle a little bit. It's kind of weird. Um, so yeah, I bought this one 
from QVC and I bought this one from QVC. Like I said, both included eye brushes. Again, it's that bundle thing for me. I really love getting a little bit more than what I'd get on the high street. You know, you're paying like $1.99 more for the post and packaging on individual items. However, you get a little bit more. You know, that brush that I got with this palette and the other palette were worth more than two pounds. So it, you know, it, it kind of works out well. But I got the Tartlet in Bloom, which is the only one I'm missing. Um, I think they've just released one like the Tartlet Juicy, which is a bit of an interesting one. But the Tartlet and Bloom is the only one I was missing and this was sold out so many times on QVC so many times and then I just kind of like forgot about it on the wayside and new things came in like you know it's just one of those things so when QVC reached out to me I was like the Tartlet and Bloom I need it to complete my collection so I'm really really happy to have this it's just beautiful lovely neutral tones hopefully you can see that there lovely lovely neutral tones kind of pulling well, yeah, just like warm and neutral, really, because when you compare it to the other two, this is the original palette. Sorry if it's kind of blinding you. This is the original Tartlet palette. This is definitely cool tone. So you've got the cool tone browns, cool tone like taupes, and the cool tone mauves. So that's really, really nice for a cool toned matte look. And then the second one, which is the Tartlet in Bloom, went on to more of those warm, neutrally tones. So you've still got kind of like the dustier cool tones here, and then warmer browns here with that lovely gold as well. It's kind of where they started introducing the shimmers as well. And then you went into the Tartlet Toasted, which was like a craze when it came out, um, which is just full on warm tones. I still love this palette to this day. It's probably one of my favourite probably like a favorite OG palette in that sort of sense. I can just put this on and it's never gonna let me down. I really truly love it, especially with my brown eyes. I feel like all of these colors look so pretty. So I'm really excited to get the Tartlet in Bloom. Should I swatch a few shades? Let's go with Funny Girl. Oof. Um, Rebel, this one looks nice. And Rocker. Ooh, it's like a taupey color. Oh my goodness. See, like, Tarte still have a really great formula. I wish I could get closer to my camera, but I've got a box on my lap. Hopefully you can see that. Like, the shimmers are really smooth, the mattes are really smooth. Everything about Tarte's formula, I genuinely just love. I find Tarte quite a difficult brand to get in the UK. I know you can get them on certain websites, but I always find that it's never the new stuff or it's just very expensive. But on QVC, it's like, the same price transferred over, but you get more for your buck. Like you get a primer included in it, or a brush included in it, or you can get a duo with some lipsticks included in it. So, ah, I've completed my little Tartlet palette collection. Very excited. Can you tell I'm very excited? Just while we're talking about Tarte as well, I want to just let you know that they do have some of their newer products as well. So, you know, although they sell like the OG palettes, the ones that we all know and love and have been around for years and years and years, they also sell some of their new products. So this is the Tarte C Cream Bronzer in the shade Breezy. I was really intrigued, oh no it's not, it's Breezy Cream Bronzer in the shade Seashells. I was really intrigued by this because I saw all of the YouTubers youtubers playing around with this bronzer and they're like oh it's so pretty it's so blendable blah, blah 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 it's beautiful and then i went on like certain websites and you know like they just didn't have them or they weren't in my shade or they were just always sold out whereas like qvc had them and they're like all fully stocked and there's demos it comes back to that thing i said in the beginning of not just a swatch that's been photoshopped or a swatch under bad lighting or filtered lighting they show them on models, like different models as well. So you can go, mm, I'm kind of more of that lady's shut or man's colour. That's better for me. So this is the cream bronzer. Look how pretty this packaging is. It's like this beautiful aqua blue. You've got tart written here. And then the shade for like my camera's really blown out today. Um, it's a really, really pretty packaging. And then inside you get a little mirror and the cream bronzer here. Let's swatch it. Oh, I don't want to ruin it, but kind of do it at the same time. Ooh. Oh, it's really slippy. That's not what I was expecting. Oh, wow. Oh, I see what they mean. It's just so, like, slick. Oh, that's interesting. And that's actually a really good shade for me. So if you're my sort of shade, I'd say I'm like a, a light. I'm not quite fair. I'm not quite light medium. I'm just like a true light shade. This is a really, really lovely colour and I'm really excited to play around with this. I'm hoping to kind of do like a chatty get ready with me and some first impressions on some of these products because I'm really intrigued and I think when, when there's a lot of US YouTubers talking about certain products, us in the UK just don't, 
we're not like tuned in with it you know we don't actually get these products in our shops until much much later but QVC have them now they have them now so we could have them now too and not have to wait three donkeys years to come and get them you know and in the same range i was really interested in their tarte c hydrocela concealer <laughs> the name is kind of entertaining hydrocela um but with this one you get the not necessarily free but it's like a duo you get the sponge with it so again comes back to that thing of you couldn't walk into boots and get a sponge you would have to pay for that separately whereas this you get it as part of the deal Ooh, it's squishy it's like a really interesting shape so this is actually a tart sponge and it does come with the concealer i got mine in the shade 12n fair neutral this is like a pretty good shade for me i like to usually shade down in my concealers just by a shade or half a shade just so it can go underneath my eyes like i said this is 12n fair neutral i just love aesthetic looking concealers and inside is almost like a flat doe for applicator let's just swatch it out Ooh, it's creamy this would actually be quite a good shade maybe i could have shaded up a little bit it is quite fair but to be honest with you like i said i prefer to shade down in my concealers or like go lighter with my concealers just to brighten and i can always blend that in with a foundation it feels really really creamy and really blendable it might be one of those concealers where you can just go really ham with and put loads on but then equally just put a little bit on like look at that that's really really nice I quite like that I quite like that again I picked up another one of these like bundles so I picked up the face tape foundation and the face tape foundation brush now if you went into a normal shop like you know the shop that sells Tarte or anything like that you'd have to pay separately for these so you'd pay like 30 pounds for this 30 pounds for that with QVC you pay like five pounds for this added into the bundle so you pay considerably less for more you know like this is what i'm saying when i'd go to qvc i wouldn't necessarily go to qvc for like one thing you could if you were just throwing it in the basket to top up your collection and whatnot or you couldn't find your shade elsewhere but for me the bundles are just where it's at and what really just appeals to me so i've got the tarte face tape foundation i couldn't actually see this on any other website in the shade that i wanted it in again it might be just like a stocking issue i don't know because it's us based makeup i got mine in the shade 22 uh n light neutral this is the tarte double duty beauty face tape foundation it's in like this airless pump it looks so pretty again i've seen so many american youtubers talk about this foundation and i'm like i want it and i can't swatch it in store there's not very good shade matches online it's just like not a lot of information sorry the pump i'm scared it's gonna like pump loads of my skin but there's just not a lot of information out there so that is the shade of the foundation that's actually looking very promising and then you get the brush with it which looked so pr oh yeah oh yeah it's like a nice density look at that it's kind of like a little bit similar to my real Tech this is so filthy my real techniques um buffing brush that i used for my foundation today it's kind of like that and it's got like this triangular sort of shape and if you can see that my camera's focusing it's got a triangular shape and a beautiful ferrule to it so that's just oh wow oh that is full coverage because that is going over the bronzer oh wow okay we're listening i mean what a great shade match that's all i'm gonna say firstly what a great shade match go me again i feel like you're gonna think i'm being paid to say this but i'm not i'm just trying to give you the reason on why i was so happy that qvc reached out to me is that this is a brilliant shade match and i did this online like i just used what they had you know i just used the pictures they had the videos they had the swatches they had the color wheel they had and look how much of a perfect shade like you can't even really see that on my skin anymore like it's just kind of vanished in there that's a really and i've got bronzer under this it's not like it's sheared out there's a bronzer streak under this that's how good a pictures and quality they put into all of the products that they put online so i've just got a really good shade match which never happens online i've got to be honest with you it's always a little bit off and this brush is so soft this might be a new favorite i don't even think a lot of brushes like tarte and it cosmetics and things like that are that accessible in the uk there's a few like for it cosmetics there's a few brushes in places like boots that are available but only they're like iconic ones rather than their full extensive range and the same with tarte like you just can't really get any of their brushes unless you go on the us website and then pay a ton in customs so i'm very excited about that 
very excited. Okay, I'm gonna, <laughs> just taking a little break from the makeup, I'm gonna get the heaviest thing that's currently sitting on my leg, giving me slight pins and needles in my left foot. And that is, okay, wait, I wanna show you the best bundle already. Right. <laughs> so this is from L'Occitane. My mum's gonna be very jealous because she loves this brand. She orders it from QVC herself. Um, we've always kind of, well not always, but like for Christmas deals and bundles, they're always really great for Christmas gifts as well. So this is L'Occitane. I'm sure, or L'Occitane? L'Occitane have a few stores in the UK. I know that there's one in the outlet near me and they're very spenny. They're very, very spenny. I'm on L'Occitane's website now and it's £33 for one of these. This is a 500ml and this is the cherry blossom one. This is actually one of my favourites. It just smells like, okay, it smells like how you would imagine, just like cherry blossom. Sweet, but light, slightly floral, and like slightly fruity at the same time. So it like walks that perfect line of freshness and like femininity. And it's so stunning. Like, look at this bottle as well. Like, imagine this just sitting on your bath, chilling out, your guests come around, they're like, oh, she's a fancy bitch. Like, yeah, I know, like, yeah. These are 33 pounds in L'Occitane's actual website and store. On QVC, you get three of them for 55 quid. And I know that sounds a lot like 55 pounds for three shower gels. And yes, it is. Like, you know me, I'm not the sort to buy really expensive shower gel. And like, because I don't really care about what's on my body. But my mum uses this all the time and I would pinch hers. I love L'Occitane stuff. And I think it's one of those things where when it's on a deal, like, for this, for example, 55 quid, me and my mum would usually split a bundle like this. And like my nan might have one, she might have two, I might have one. But I've paid less for it, you know? It makes them £18 each as opposed to like £33 each. And at that price, I would have one as a luxurious thing. I love some luxury bath products every now and again. I just don't depend on them. I could give this to my mum for her birthday with some chocolates or something and she'd know how expensive this is. And she'd be like, Oh my goodness, thank you, you know? So if you like luxury bath products and you like L'Occitane, you might as well buy the bundles on QVC. Um, and I feel like it sounds like I'm repping them, but I'm just being honest and trying to save you a deal if you buy them already. If you want them and you're intrigued, you might as well go on the QVC website, buy a bundle. If it's too much, if it's too out of your budget, but you still want to try them, see if you can split it with someone. Like I said, I'd normally split something like this with my mum if we saw them on the QVC website, which we've done tons and tons of times for, especially around Christmas. Um, we've bought bundles for people or like we've bought bundle and split it into two because you maybe get two full size of something and two smaller sizes of something else. We split it for people and it's a brilliant present and you get a brilliant deal in comparison to paying the full price that you would in other shops or L'Occitane's website themselves. Again, just talking about L'Occitane for a little bit longer, I'm gonna show you another bundle that they had on their shop and I just couldn't resist. So this is a bundle that I literally had to get when I saw it. This is 45 pounds for the Cherry Blossom and Verbena. Uh, I think it's Cherry Blossom and Verbena or Vervine. No, it's Verbena, I'm sure. Cherry Blossom and Verbena bundle pack. So you get the 500 ml Cherry Blossom shower gel. Oh, it's actually a bath and shower gel. I didn't know that, it's a bath and shower gel. Um, and then you also get the it says Vervine, but I always call it Verbena. Have I been calling it wrong my whole life? It's quite possible. That's embarrassing. But you also get the 500ml version of that too. But then in this bundle, you also get the smaller sizes. So you get the 250ml of each too. So again, it comes back to that thing of you could go and buy a bundle knowing that someone's birthday is coming up or like, you know it's your mum's birthday, you know it's your aunt's birthday, you know it's your nan's birthday, you know, like it's someone's birthday or it's as a reason to celebrate something for yourself, girl. Then you can go on and just buy a bundle of stuff, but you could split it. For me, it's be a perfect splitting bundle because it's the same thing but a smaller size and a bigger size so you could get the bigger size of that like that and like that so you could give them to two people like that or you could keep the two big ones for yourself because you know you've got to look out for number one first and you could give the two 250 mil away as a good gift or you could even split it up into four separate gifts and do you know two people that are a bit of a lower end gift in what lower end they're still bloody expensive so each one of these small ones i think it's about 17 pounds from what i remember because i've bought one of these in the loxton uh, outlet shop where i talked about the outlet shop near me and i've bought these before and they're about 15 17 pounds each which is pretty expensive so when you can get all of this for 45 quid it's like that's a no-brainer, you know? Um, and like I said, if you like luxury bath products or you want to 
get something nice for someone you love or you just want to treat yourself like it's a really really good way to do that and you save a lot of money you know i'm gonna have a little sniffle of these because these are genuinely my fave i love just like cherry blossom like just they do cherry blossom right there's a couple of brands that that I'd say are competitors to Loxton that don't do cherry blossom right and it's too overpowering and perfumey. Ugh. This reminds me of, um, you know, swizzle lollies, like the fruit pop lollies. This reminds me of like the lemony one, like the lemon and lime, really fresh fragrance. And then this is the sweeter one. Ugh. Oh, it's just so sexual. I love it. But yeah honestly go check them out i know i'm not gonna be that person that's like christmas is around the corner it's not it's august okay christmas is not around the corner however it is four months away and if you're starting to think about doing present shopping now i'm not one of those people but if you're starting to think about that uh in september october time and you just want to get it all done out the way then get some value packs get some bundles i'm sure they have some bundles as well closer to christmas i'm just saying think about it because they're truly truly lovely bath products and i know i'm speaking about them a lot it's because i love them and like i don't buy them very often because they're so spenny but qvc do them for a bundle and i can share this with my mum and she's gonna love me and i'm gonna be her favorite child okay <laughs> look at this look at this i'm gonna open my own store Oh, you know, earlier I said about having new items. I really, really wanted to try this. This is the Benefit the Pore Professional Setting Spray, or Super Setter, sorry. It says 93% said it perfects the look of makeup, washproof, smudge-proof, fade-proof. Interesting. I really, really wanted to try this, and I actually worked out that it was cheaper to get it on QVC with postage and packaging, with postage packaging, than it was to get it in boots. I really, really wanted to try this out. This is like a brand new product from Benefit. Um, well, it might not be brand brand new in the scheme of things because like something new comes out every single week But ooh, that smells really nice. This is something I really want to try. It's a long-lasting makeup setting spray It says the professional super setter is a lightweight microfine mist that helps lock on makeup softens the look of pores and feels lightweight After applying makeup shake well and hold eight inches from the face mist evenly all over That's exactly what I'm gonna do I've seen so many people talk about this and how much they like it, so I have high hopes. Oh. Oh, wow, that's a really soft mess. Mmm. You genuinely can't feel that mist. That's even softer than my All Nighter Setting Spray by Urban Decay. That's really intriguing. That is so light. So I'm like looking in the mirror. That's so light. I've just set down transferred mascara, though. That's good of me, isn't it? What a beauty guru I am. <laughs> yeah, that's really interesting. Hmm. This is 120 ml and it's about 25 pounds. So it's about average, I'd say, like on par with Urban Decay and brands like that. But oosh. It's like set my makeup down and just made everything look really soft, to be fair. Something I had to get a backup for is something I bloody love and I bought from QVC last time. Um, it's the IT CC Illumination SPF 50 Colour Correcting Full Coverage Cream Hydrating and Anti-Aging Concealer. It's just their CC cream basically. This is my one. <laughs> Look how loved it is. Oh, can it's gonna focus? Is it gonna focus? It's, um, she's, she's used. She's used and abused. She was loved. There's a tiny, tiny bit left of this, but I love this cc cream it's amazing it's a perfect traveling foundation kind of it's kind of a foundation it's kind of a cc cream it's kind of a bit of both i love the like luminosity offers without being shiny um i actually lent this to lily who if you don't know lily she's my best friend and she actually has oily skin the complete opposite skin type to me and she really got along with this so don't be put off by the illumination factor if you're oily this is still really really nice it just offers luminosity it doesn't make you look greasy. It's really, really nice. I've never tried their like normal one. I've just fallen in love with this one. So I've decided to carry on, you know, like why ruin a good thing? Why why cheat on something when you've got a good thing going on? Um, so I really wanted a backup of this. I'm very, very excited. I bought this on QVC. Again, it's coming full circle and I've now been gifted a refill by QVC themselves. It's just crazy to me. I love it. I, I genuinely stand by this. I genuinely stand by this. It's a great product. Great for traveling as well. Also, SPF 50. Holla at me. I'm here for it. This is, 
<laughs> this is also why I didn't go for like duo pack or anything because I was like oh I couldn't possibly buy a duo pack I've got so many foundations I'm gonna have to buy another foundation this is it cosmetics your skin but better foundation and skincare like all in one which I was really really intrigued by and um, it also comes with a brush I'll show you that in a second I really wanted to get this from my local drugstore but they didn't have any in the shop it was all online the swatches weren't great and I was just like well do you know what like I don't want to get the wrong shade like when you're paying a lot for a foundation or any makeup product for that matter you don't want to get the wrong shade but this is the it cosmetics your skin but better foundation I'm sure you've seen the adverts this isn't new new but it's it cosmetics latest foundation and i got mine in the shade fair neutral 11 um oh it's a lovely hand pump i have taken off the foundation from the other hand by the way like i've taken this off now so let me just do a little pump of this oh it's very watery oh that's interesting it smells nice as well but it also came with a kabuki brush now look how bougie this is i love it cosmetics brushes i think they are so 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 good quality so the fact that this was a bundle a foundation that i hadn't tried but i was intrigued about and i got a kabuki brush with it i was like yes to the please ma'am yes to the please it's like similar to the kabuki brush that i got um last time like all these years ago when i bought the cc cream but it's like longer has a bigger handle and my one was like smaller it was more of like this like sort of size to just buff in around the nose this one's like a proper foundation brush i'm ready Ooh. oh that's nice oh yeah that's really nice again a really good shade match i feel like it's disappeared into my hand i have got a tendency of putting two warmer foundation on my face because i bronze a lot as well so it makes everything look a little bit orange i feel like i get usually a good shade match sort of but again i put on a lot of bronzer a lot of warmth i love looking warm and glowy and blah so sometimes having a slightly lighter foundation is better for me because i'm not orange off the like off the bat so the fact that that has a shade matched so perfectly is lovely it's got a nice sheen to it as well that kabuki brush and if you can see this it's so soft and I'm not going to lie, when I first felt it, I was like, mm, that's not going to push product around very well, is it? But actually, because it's so soft and it's a flat top one, it like just buffs in the product beautifully without streaking it up. Streaking it up? Making streaks in it. Mmm. It's not as firm as the Tarte brush, but it's like, it feels velvety. Like this one feels firm, like it's going to buff in. This one feels like a cloud where you're just sort of pushing the product over the skin. What a look this is, but that's interesting. I've just had a look and on Top Beauty and Boots where they sell It Cosmetics, this is a £32.50 foundation. On QVC, the bundle with the lovely brush, I'm not just saying it, I would tell you if it's like a meh brush. This is actually really, really nice. I feel like a powder foundation, this would be nice as well. Like it's just genuinely like a nice buffing brush but i got this on a bundle for 36 pounds so for four pounds more you can have the brush that's like worth a good 30 quid by itself like this is a good brush and the foundation it's not even a four pounds more it's like three pound fifty more so do you see what i mean about these bundles if you just want the one foundation sure buy it somewhere else do it wh whatever you want or throw it in the basket by itself get a few pounds off not big a difference but if you want the bundle if you want to save money if you want to get more for your money go no further that's all i'm saying that is all i'm saying i got another bundle <laughs> i feel like i need to do hashtag bundle every time i say bundle maybe you can start this video again get some shots get your friends and every time i use the word bundle you can drink i think you'd be drunk within 15 minutes perhaps maybe possibly yeah i got this bundle um this is <laughs> fun fact this is actually something that i bought off of qvc again as well and i and i got i got another one because it's so beautiful this is like their renowned brush it's like their french boutique brush or something like that and this this brush is sensational so when i saw it in a bundle bundle i was like hell yeah girl i want another one i want to back up one of these why would I have a Morphe brush when I can have this Divine It Cosmetics brush? Also, I love how, like, they all, like, obviously it's plastic and not ideal. I don't like unnecessary plastic. However, there's, like, no tape 
no excess packaging it's just is what it is in the tube you can always save these as well sometimes these are great for traveling i would never travel with a brush like this like a really expensive brush without something protecting it so actually you could possibly that's the wrong lid but you could possibly save this and travel with your brushes like that if you're precious about them like me i'm obsessive i'm obsessive but this one came in a bundle with the it's bye bye pause blush again something i've never been able to swatch but i've been always intrigued about it for me i have i don't have enlarged pores but sometimes certain blushes can make my pores here look quite enlarged nine out of ten times i don't care because i'm confident enough to be like why are you looking so close at my face then what what have you got against my pores maybe they just want to say hello to you i'm not too bothered however if I can avoid it, I will. This is the Je Ne Sais Quoi Natural Pink Blush. If I can get it open. And I've always been intrigued by these because I think they just look like nice blushes. And It Cosmetics do nice products anyway that I've always been intrigued by them. Hello. <laughs> that gave me shivers. <laughs> Ooh. I've always been intrigued by It Cosmetics, but again, it's like lack of swatches, lack of pi good pictures. And when you can see models actually applying them in videos, uh, it, it, it's quite nice. And you get it in a bundle, 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 bundle. Are you drunk yet? I hope you are. Cheers, cheers. This is great. This is great. So this blush in many retailers is £24. £24 for a blush, I'd say is expensive it's like up there with benefit it's like expensive but it's not unaffordable you know it's not unattainable 24 pounds is like woof, but it's not like unattainable it's not like ridiculous you know um and then this brush itself is a 30 pound brush that is quite expensive for a blush brush however it's just like so beautiful it's got this weighted um pearl like beady i don't know what to call it it's like sphere here sphere here sphere here it's really lovely so you hold it here and that's how you get your application so you can hold it here or you can hold it here for lighter here's like the perfect sort of blush intensity and obviously if you do it closer to the ferrule you get more of an intense blush but this is like where you're supposed to hold it and it's like a comfort thing and a weighted thing so you can see it's weighted really really nice brush this is a 30 pound brush a 24 pound blush blush and a brush you get this in a bundle from qvc for 30 pounds You heard it right. You heard it right, girl. £30 for the blush and the brush. So if you wanted this brush, go to QVC because you get the free blush, basically. Basically. Like, that. that's how it goes. So when I saw this bundle, I was like, oh, hi, hi, me again. Just thought I'd come and check out this. <laughs> there were three shades of this. There was this one, which is Je Ne Sais Quoi, which is this lovely peachy apricotty pink. And um, there was a more pinkier toned one and then a mauvey toned one, which would be great for deeper skin tones, I think, from these swatches. Um, let's, let's get into this. Should I just put a little bit? I mean, I've already got blush on, but... Ooh. It also has like a nice little mirror in here, by the way, which is quite nice. Ooh, that's a really nice shade. I'm not sure if you can tell because I've already got blush on, but you can kind of see like the warmth there in comparison to here. I don't know if you can see that. That's like one pass of the blush. It's a pretty buildable blush from what I can see. It's very fine, very, very finely milled. It's actually really, really pretty. It's kind of like leaning more pink, but the undertone of it is apricotty, so it looks really like warm and juicy on the on the and he said the lid the cheek but actually when you swatch it it is more pink it's quite like a transformative blush that's really interesting um it says poreless finish airbrush brightening blush mm, i feel like i need to even myself out now because i look a little bit like I'm, I'm, a, I'm a crazy person finally there was one more bundle that i was really intrigued about this is the it cosmetics pillow cream high pigment moisture wrapping lipstick now, this is a bundle of two lipsticks you could get like the red duo the pink duo or the nude or, like neutral duo um and i got the neutral duo because i can't help myself i love a neutral lipstick and this was 26 pounds for two lipsticks and on other retailers like cult beauty and boots and places like that they're 21 pound a lipstick so if you already wanted one and they're like oh i can get two or i can share it with a friend because they want the other shade then you might as well get the bundle on um qvc and get two for half the price basically oh my goodness look how pretty that is 
oh my goodness, I didn't realise how pretty these are. It's like opalescent, pearly, pillowy shade. That's so pretty. This is the shade Like a Dream, and it's cream lipstick. Oh my goodness. So that's what it looks like inside. So pretty. Let's uh, let's swatch this out. This is actually the darker of the two. So there was a more um, lighter shade. I'll show you what it looks like. Hang on. So there was a Vision, which is on your right, I think. Basically this one here next to my thumb. That's a Vision, which is the one they were out of stock of, but they're gonna send me afterwards. And then there's Like a Dream on the right. My camera is like flipping you all over the place. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, hot damn, girl. I love the packaging as well. Like how cute is that? I love that, it's so heavy as well. So that is Like a Dream, that shade right there. So again, if you're looking to get a couple of lipsticks or you're looking to get more than one thing from certain brands like It, Tarte, Benefit, those American brands, go to QVC for the bundles. I'm telling you, the bundles are where it's at. So that's it, there were a couple of things that were out of stock when they sent this to me, which were the Hula, bronzer glow which is their new bronzer which i was pretty intrigued about just to see how like paired up with the normal hula they also did that in a bundle as well and um, they were sold out of that at the time which is fine um, and then obviously the other lipstick which they were out of stock of at the time which again is fine um and also i ordered which they are going to send me i think i'm not really sure but i think they're going to do that is there was like a chamois cloth trio i'll see if you can i'll see if i can put it up like an image on the screen now so this is the face cloth chamois trio and um, they all came individually wrapped because they've got kind of this really interesting texture i was expecting a microfiber cloth but all three of these are kind of this porous foamy really sort of very movable material it's very very peculiar nothing i've ever seen before really really interesting as you can see here it's very porous you could definitely cut this into smaller pieces if you wanted to but i think these are actually a really good size for the entire face i actually did wet a corner of it and see if i could wipe off some makeup so i put some lipstick on and let it sit there for a while wiped it off and it came off with no effort at all so can you imagine with these with like cleanser I i'm really intrigued i think these are really really cool really really innovative and I can't wait to use them. I think they're really, really different. I want to save you guys money if you're going to purchase something. I recommend products all the time. And if I'm going to recommend them to you and you're going to go and buy them, you might as well save as much money as possible um, and get the best deal for your bang, like bang for your buck. Get the best deal for your bang? No, get the best deal... You know what I mean, it's been a long day. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. I'm definitely gonna put all of these products in my little basket of makeup I haven't tried out yet and incorporate them into some new like full face makeup videos. I think that would be really, really cool, including some of the brushes, because I think sometimes we cast our eyes over really good brushes and we don't have to do that all the time, especially when you can get a little bundle. I hope you're on like your 40th shot right now, because like I've said it enough, I'm actually irritating myself. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and thank you to QVC for gifting me this lovely box of goodies to share with you all and to hopefully give my first impressions and to give my review of any of the products that you might be more interested in. Please do just comment down below if there's a particular product you've seen and you're like, give me the tea, give me the tea. I'll give it to you in a video. Just tell me down below if there's anything that particularly intrigues you or you would like to know more about. Um, I'll link QVC down in my description bar if you'd like to go shop their website. If you've never shopped from them before, where have you been? Have you been under a rock? Or do you go to bed before 12 o'clock when every other human's asleep and I'm like watching the QVC on my TV at like one in the morning, I'm like, hi, I'm here to shop makeup at one in the morning. No, just me? I do it. Thank you guys for watching. I really do appreciate you. Talk to me down below. It's my favorite, favorite part about uploading. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.